wanted to do a second quick video to walk you through some of the options that you have for your survey. So if I go back to the survey Barbara for that I created for Barbara, uh, I wanted to show you, first of all, you can customize the theme, which is very fun and you can make the picture change which will also give you different options for the theme color. You can also change the font and just have fun with the different options. After you have fun, please note that you can delete questions, you can duplicate questions so that you can easily change them. Keep your survey short since your audience will be filling out multiple surveys and you do not want to overwork your audience on your topic and wear them out before your speech. You just need to gather a few key pieces of information that you can use in your speech. Now, when you have finalized your form, you're going to go back up here to the three dots and you're going to say get pre-filled link. As you select that, you'll have to scroll to the bottom. And this, of course, shows you the survey that your audience will see. Get the link. Now you want to copy the link. It has been copied to our clipboard. So now we can head back over to our discussion board and we're going to post that survey link on the Google document. So I'm gonna have to delete, oh, I'm gonna have to delete that link so that I can post a new one. And all I need to do is hit link. And then when I get down here, I can paste the link because it's already on my clipboard, hit apply, and then there's a link. It is quite lengthy. And last time when I posted the link, I selected the option shorten it. So you're welcome to do that. Either way, it will take us to the survey that I've created for Barbara. You also can rename your link so that it's not awkward and um, easier to handle, but you do not have to. That obviously does the job. As you can see, we are now in Barbara's No Christmas survey. Hopefully this will help you as you post your links. I know I didn't explain that in the last video, so I wanted to do that. Have fun with Google Forms. Let me know if you have questions. And I'm so proud of you for being brave and embracing Google Forms, I think you'll really appreciate the options that they give.